Hello there. Today marks the beginning of a series of videos I will share to make you reflect on what truly matters in life and provide you with tools to work on aspects that influence our well-being, serenity and fulfillment. We will also explore how to raise our level of consciousness. I invite you to join me and enjoy a new episode and topic every week. I want to share profound reflections with you in this first episode, inspired by various life experiences. Often, we seek security in external things like owning a house, securing a stable job, having substantial savings, finding a fulfilling partner, becoming parents, or advancing in our careers. However, while aspirations are not wrong, these elements can vanish at any moment. Real security in life comes from knowing who you are and who you are becoming. That is, a better version of yourself daily. We cannot rely on external factors for fulfillment. It comes from within. So now, how can we make sure that we are making progress? Well, every night I suggest you ask yourself three questions to evaluate your growth. What did I learn today? How did I contribute or improve something? And what did I enjoy? We find ourselves at a crossroads every moment, regardless of our circumstances. So now forget about your past and think about who you are today, regardless of who you used to be. And now, Think about who you want to become, what kind of person you aspire to be. This is a significant decision you must consciously make. And based on this, you will need to make some changes. The problem often lies in lacking a sense of urgency to implement those changes. We tend to settle into our usual patterns, even if we don't fully feel satisfied even if we have a feeling of dissatisfaction, frustration, anxiety, this lack of urgency prevents us from genuinely committing the, to the transformation process. Changes truly begin when we stop questioning whether we should change and adopt an unwavering conviction that we will change no matter what, that we will make it happen. Otherwise, it's just empty words. So allow me to invite you to consider some beliefs that can support you in your changes if you are determined to carry them out. One is, I need to change. That's it. I have had enough of this state of affairs. No more procrastination. No more excuses. No more tomorrow. Now. Another one is, I no longer believe that things will change independently of what others do. I won't wait for the economic situation to improve, for my boss to stop pressuring me, for my colleagues to become more pleasant, for my partner to be more attentive, for my friends to include me more, or for my company to recognize the potential I have. I need to change now. If we want it to endure, we must become the source of change. Otherwise, it will be volatile, ephemeral, and always beyond our control. And the last belief I invite you to adopt is, I am convinced that I can change. If we don't believe that change is possible, that we can create it in ourselves, and that it's not merely an illusion or an abstract idea, it will be impossible to achieve it. Humans have the power to do incredible things. We possess tremendous innate abilities. But if these three premises are not fulfilled, we will build castles in the sand and they will collapse as soon as a wave comes in. 